Welcome back everyone to Let's Play Victory at Sea Pacific, episode number 12. Um, reloading the game appears to have fixed the bug. I mean, I'm getting the wildcats that I wanted launch. They're starting to launch. So we'll unpause, which for the last time I remember is not spacebar. And we'll see how this goes. Now, obviously, it does not look good. Um, what? Okay, so I think... I think something happened. What? Wait, what? Oh god. What? I see them. Where are they, though? Are they engaging? Where are you? Okay, there they are. Um, I. It looks like all the Japanese planes are going back. Certainly was not the design here. If I can get this guy to increase his altitude, that would also be nice. So I'm not really sure what happened. Um, gosh, I really wish I knew, too. Okay. Can you guys intercept? You guys are, are already intercepting, I think, or being intercepted by these fighters. So that's going to work. We're going to kill a spotter. Hey, we got something out of this, right? No, it's not killing a spotter. Attack this. I don't know what's going on here. That might be uh, trying to go for its original mission, which is kill the other ones. Are these fighters going after my torpedo bombers? Okay, these fighters are actually over. I want to see this. So the Battle of Midway is, is definitely in full force now. Oh. Oh, these are... What the hell? These are dive bombers. Oh my gosh. The dive bombers made it to the island, and I thought these weren't dive bombers. I thought they were fighters. Okay, well, we need to scramble. You, how far away are you? Not too bad. Return. Help. Intercept aircraft. Don't care about the P. Intercept the valves. Have they already done their damage? What did they do? Looks like our AAA is engaging, which is great. They probably came in a little bit too low. I just, I love, look at the flak. I don't know if you can see it, but they're putting up a flak wall. A bunch of black dots. Oh man, good luck. This is, I mean, I, I remember my Devastators didn't make it, but they were doing like level bombing. Look at all that ordnance. Look at all those shells. They're just filling the sky with metal. Hoping that some of the shrapnel gets the job done. So I don't think that they've done any damage to Midway yet, but maybe they have. And these valves look like they're going to evade. Okay. Uh, but we are about to intercept. And get these guys on an intercept course as well. And these are all dive bombers we do not want returning. This is good, so maybe I should just do everything from the tactical map, which is going to be a little bit tricky, but, so you should be landing, you are. Let me actually get, are these guys on a good intercept course? Are we not closing the distance? Well, this sh hopefully will save, I don't know. Um. Is there an option? Oh, oh, I think this is a mod I was looking at. There's an option to like not deploy with bombs and then your fighters are slightly faster. Now definitely the Wildcats are faster than the Vals. I mean the one thing that the Wildcat had going for it was that it was fast. Okay, beginning intercept. Let's see what happens here. Here we go. We're going in. I don't know if their box formation allows them to help self, um, help protect each other, which would be accurate. This is literally one fighter. I think the game is still a little bit bugged. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. This should be a flight of four, and they should be able to catch Vals. What in God's name? What in God's name is going on? All right, look. 
I don't know what's going on, so what we're going to do is intercept the ones behind us. Let me just give the whole order. Turn to formation and intercept this. How's this guy doing? What, is, what are they doing? I don't know. We have some zeros flying over. Yeah, again, I mean, basically this, this is like so exciting from some perspective, but then it's losing its appeal slightly because these bugs, right? I don't know what to do. Okay, well they've spotted the zeros. Are we going to get some anti-aircraft fire on them? Again, every one we take out is one less we have to deal with. So I think the... Ah, I really don't know what happened here. Let me just give them an order to, oddly enough, attack this fleet, which will get them going that way. And look, we have random fighters, probably from these other ones. That's why they're going slow, because they want to rejoin formation. I get it. Well, look. Attack this zero. I don't know what happened to the other ones. Let's just... Let's see if this works. Let me... Like, leave this... What the hell is going on? My god. Uh, this is weird. This is very weird. The fighters appear to be doing that. So what do we have here? Another pair of wildcats. Let's get them to take off. And we have some dauntlesses. Let's get them to take off. Let's just get... Launch everything, right? There's no point. Catalina torpedo bombers. Useless to me. Swap them out for... Preferably wildcats. just get rid of these actually no let's not get rid of them because the points I don't want to game the system too much I at least want to make sure I'm holding these points in the bay so in other words not enabling them not liberating the points for use elsewhere at least constricting the points to this so it looks like our b-17 finally died we'll get a uh, get a dauntless there okay so what do we have can we recap what we have going on here I, I have no idea I'm just gonna let time continue for a little bit all these fighters man what how long have they been up for okay, die bombers make your approach from the south uh, no yeah, it looks like they're actually returning no they are not there's a whole group of ones that are not returning did we just take some damage? We did. We're down to one. Yeah, we didn't kill a single fighter there. We have another group engaging. Maybe. Maybe not. Okay, look, I just want to kill anything. Just kill something. And especially if you can protect the dive bombers, that's even better. So just, I don't know, kill the spotter. Let's make them blind. Do something. <laughs> It's not anything. <laughs> okay, here goes this guy. I don't know if he caused any losses before he died horribly. Uh, this fighter is not listening to orders. Well, he's going to get tracked down eventually, so we'll have him attack these dive bombers. Maybe they get that done. That doesn't look good for our dauntlesses. We have, like, nobody up. And we have a whole bunch of wildcats ready to go. I prefer to launch them individually, but let's launch one group of two and see if that gets things done any better. Oh god, our fleet is lost. No, our torpedo boats are here. What is going on? My goodness. Where the hell are these things? Just like random. It's so random. Alright, let's get a CTF. I know you haven't done your raid yet, but guess what? You have bigger fish to fry. We need your help in midway. Same reason why I'm pulling Task Force 6 back. There's just and it's sad that I lost all those devastators to, I mean, wait, Dauntlesses even, to needless attacks on Wake Island, but live and learn. The Enterprise herself has almost a completely full complement, and the only two damaged are devastators, so that's, we're fine with that. Let's go ahead and get the devastators to return. I, I mean, I guess we can actually do a raid with the devastators. It will slow down our, yeah, but I think it's worth it to get the points. We can see that the points are going to be very necessary soon to rebuild what shattered remains of Midway remain. Yeah, whatever remains remain. <laughs> That's right. So get these guys to move this way. 
Okay, that was very quick. Um, get them. Okay, so I. What? What the hell? What? Let let them alone. Let them do their thing. Hopefully, they are able to do their thing. Let's say eight fighters. Let's go in and watch the brawl. I think they're about to get intercepted. So we have four and four. Here we go. They're engaging. Now all we're looking for here is some zero kills. All we're looking here, all we're looking for here is any zero kills. Like any. Okay. Oh god. Okay. Can't tell. This one's definitely intact. Alright, my system's bugged now. One, two, three, let's pause. One, two, three, one. Go. What did they die bone before? Are they? Did we? Did we do it? Did we hit hit one? I don't know. They're. Okay, so maybe one of them's. Gone. I don't think we should be able to see anymore. Is that what's happening? Yeah. Oh, maybe we killed one. Or is that our Dauntless still? Is that a zero? No, that's a Dauntless. Okay, let's look on the radar then and see if they have any less than four fighters. Yeah, this is... Oh, one fighter. Okay, so we took out three? I'm okay with that. Losing eight for three, this is... Like I said, the ratio I was observing was something like six to one, so... Alright, let's call in all the... Basically call in all the fighters. Everything that possibly could have been based at Midway, we're going to scramble it. Which, now we're getting a little unrealistic. But, just remember, I'm not... <laughs> I'm not going to free these points... We're, we're gonna try to pay for them. All right, we have one Catalina, which is one Dauntless. These things are not. Let's get a Dauntless instead of the Catalina, at least. We're going to go away. We're gonna look back at the Enterprise, who has sorted out her stuff. Hooray! She actually has. Um. Yeah, so you're now tasked with moving, that's good. And carry your task force, no, that's a sub, damn. We're really far away from the action. Well, we better start scrambling, I think pairs of, let's go with pairs. Look, it's still all an experiment to figure out how this game works. But let's go with pairs and see if that helps at all. Um, I really need to go in on these guys, they're in formation, but they're probably really low. Okay, good. Give you guys the standing order to... Oh, this is great. I think we're actually going to manage to do some damage with these guys. This is nice. Okay, so at least I'll be able to do the raid on Wake Island, assuming that... I think I have to stay in this mode for these guys to work. If I leave this screen, I have a terrible feeling that they're going to drop back down. You know what? I don't care. <laughs> I don't know what's going on in Midway. It was a total Charlie Fox trot anyway. So we're going to, you know, do what we can, which is raid Marshall Islands. Wait, no, this is uh, Wake Island. I almost called it making a toll. They're all jumbled in my head. Oh wait, what is this? Okay, I thought I saw damage on those. I was just seeing white from the icon with the red. I did not obviously want to damage those. All right, so we have one, two emplacements left, and then we have free rain. Um, well, let's take them out for sure. 
Coastal guns don't bother me. We can always come back for those. I can even launch my Dauntlesses. Uh, no, wait. Actually, I'm not sure if the Dauntlesses... Because, yeah, there's bugs and, you know, things crash and whatever. We're going to have to give an order very soon. What, what do we want to do? Okay, well, obviously... We need to prioritize these two AA. I'm going to give two full flights to that. These guys are going to attack. I guess we can attack their hospital. I want to... Maybe kill their control tower. Oh, god, we're coming in too fast. And you will attack... their barracks, I guess. It's not too late. Jeez. Okay, we lost one. We lost a whole flight. And we left one... Wow, one AAA did all that work, huh? Am I mistaken? Is there more AAA I'm not looking at? Good lord. Oh, you know what they probably did when I gave them an attack order? They probably... Um, yeah, I think I know what happened. They probably lowered their altitude. Okay, what's going on with Midway? Let's just look. God forbid something happened. Alright. Um, what's amazing is somehow this wildcat made it beyond the fleet. What? Go home. Where? Are, what are you doing out here? But we have a chance to look at the fleet. So the, we have the Akagi. We have the Kirishima. The Hiryu. Hiryu. <laughs> I hear you. And the Zuakaku. I mean, this is amazing. We, uh, we gotta, we have to strike. This is it. We have to take out the Japanese carriers. The Japanese flat tops. Looks like they're turning north in order to engage. Uh, man. Brutal. Now, I don't know what happens. It looks like we actually survived without... When I didn't pay attention, we did something good. <laughs> so they're launching a bunch of what, torpedo bombers. Attack those. Can I? I know it's one fighter, but hey, can we attack those torpedo bombers? Oh, this is certain death. You know what? Just go wait out here. I don't know why they're launching torpedo bombers. We don't want to launch into the enemy fleet. That's obviously going to have some pretty negative consequences for the the poor wildcat. Who has somehow made it this far, which is, like I said, a miracle. We don't have enough um, ammunition. They actually model it, so you, I think you're only allowed to engage in two um, air combats, or maybe it's even one, where you, if you kill one set of airplanes, you are out of ammunition. So I don't want to waste it on this Pete. I definitely want to take out these Kates. Heaven knows what they're even doing. But hey, I have some Wildcats now in the air. They look like they're actually climbing. I mean, it looks like they aren't totally spazzing out. Which is good. I'm very happy to see that. <coughs> Sorry about that. I was pretty good about muting in one of the episodes, and I, I think I did not do such a good job in the last two. <laughs> Alright, they're far enough away. Let's go ahead and do give the order to intercept. And... Do I want to watch? No, don't. Okay, well, let's see if this fighter gets the job done. I very much doubt it, but he's lost in a wave of garbage, so good luck to him. Uh, let's also deploy our remaining wildcats once again.
wait for those guys. Okay, so... This group came back alive. No. Okay, that guy's dead. Swap him. Just buy another one. Uh, I don't know where the line is where it becomes too cheesy. <laughs> You never know, because if you want to factor in how terrible these things are performing and how buggy they are, maybe <laughs> maybe I'm just allowed to launch infinite of them. <laughs> okay, so those fighters must have killed off my B-17. Yeah, I don't know what's going on with a couple of these guys. Two, three, four. So I don't know which ones. I'm just going to have to replace all of them until I get it. Oh, got it on the first try. We get rid of you. Buy some more. All right, let's just get rid of the. I wanna. I don't wanna save the points, but I just. I won't be spending the points on anything. I just get rid of everything that's not. Yeah, one of these things. In fact, let me just get rid of them. Uh, and build some more, just so I know for sure that the ones I'm putting in are not bad. Okay, I'll just keep swapping until I find that broken one. There it is. So now the top should be that. We'll just get rid of all of them again. Build some replacements. And hey, we're good to go. And here's Midway putting up its basically what I would say its final defense. Um, good news is all this aircraft maneuvering stuff is causing their aircraft carriers to constantly turn facing north. Um, other good news is I think our fighters should have a chance to actually intercept some bombers at some point. Like they can't deploy fighters. I guess they deployed a whole screen of fighters. I thought that they were deploying them reactively, but now I think they didn't do that. They probably deployed them uh, as an escort, as a screen. Which is smart. It's definitely what I would have done. Alright, so forget that spotter. And go after one of these crazy piles of things. Like these dive bombers. Can I give you orders? If you can actually go after those 15, I don't know what will happen. I assumed basically that the fighters would get to me first, but... There's a group of 14 dive bombers in there. Let's go after those. These guys will go after whoever's remaining. We're definitely taking some casualties. I don't know if I want to watch. Uh, so it's 15, 12. Okay, I see well, there's a group of 15, a 12, and a... F I think we did not kill any 15 fighters. Hard to tell. Terrible damage is being done <laughs> to us, not to them. Hey, you're about to intercept someone else. Forget about the spotter. Okay, here comes the next attack wave. Are we mixing with the dive bombers? I can't tell. Some part of me wants to just shoot down the spotting plane because, hey, at least we can take that out, right? I've seen it happen. No. Can you... Okay, let me pause. I can get the Imperial Japanese. Oh, they are doing work. Okay, well, let's go after... I don't, I honestly care most about the fighters. Let's try to take out this group of fighters. Did I lose you? Hello? Can't attack? What do you mean I can't attack? Are you engaged right now? With a spotter? Whatever, there's a soul dive bomber who we'll just go after because it's the only thing I can right click on. I don't want to be bothered doing this. Uh, I mean, this is just an, it's supposed to be an exciting mission, right? Like, oh my gosh, here they are. Scramble everything. Uh, and that's how we should continue to perceive it, despite the you know, other difficulties. 
so go after these. Oh, uh, you're going home. Okay. Wait, why? They might be dead. <laughs> but I see a pair that we haven't launched yet. Scramble everything. The dive bombers are on their way, so these guys, I mean, if they can even get up to that height fast enough. No, don't. What? I don't understand why. Why are you going back to land? Okay, let's try to take matters into our own hands. I didn't want to do this, but let's try to just force wildcats to do the right thing. That is way too close. Okay, so go after these dive bombers then. Just do something. Do something for just, yeah, something. And now what's going on here? You guys have ammunition and you're not going after these dive bombers. If you can explain that to me. Well, you're out of ammunition, so you're feel free to land. But there's some dive bombers here, and I expect you to do the right thing and go after them. And the other wildcats, yeah, are like in perfect position to... I know, oddly enough, we actually want to go after this zero. <laughs> And one of you guys can go after a Kate, just to limit the number of casualties, but the torpedo bombers are going to get slaughtered wholesale by... Okay, what what's going on above us? Vals? Let's turn back this way. Keep climbing. Keep climbing. Ruin their lead, even though at this point we'd already be taking fire. I guess we're approaching from underneath, so maybe not. All right, he's intercepting. This is good. We have a real chance here to, to do something. Approaching. And they're engaging each other now. All right, we did it. All right, and they're out of ammunition. This is what I would have expected, at least based on the fact that they seem to wreck our stuff very easily. Um, I don't know why... You guys are going after theirs. Did we already defeat? Ah, their zeros are there. Not really sure why, but hey, we'll fight at sea level. I don't think that's an advantage for the Wildcats, but fair enough. Here we go. In we go. And they're beginning. Zeros have climbed on the Wildcats. Not a bad idea. Oh my god. Are any of theirs dying? That's what I'm looking for. I see four still. And that is how um, these brawls go. Zero to four. Don't really understand it. That's just the way they've always been going for me though. Alright, well, hopefully this wildcat will have more success. And I think I can just click on the island directly. We can do a little bit of swapping in and out. Yeah, you know what? I'll cheese everything. Because I feel like this game is not balanced. I'm doing some self-correcting balancing issues. <laughs> because this is just bizarre that a, a four zeros take out four wildcats without ever taking damage. Continuously. Now, is it a good time to be launching an aircraft while we're being dive bombed on? Well, what better time? <laughs> Let's just intercept the Kates. In fact, let me just do this piecemeal. Um, I don't even know what these guys are going after. And I don't even know who I'm clicking on. Maybe we can intercept some vowels. Something like this. Alright, let's just watch it happen now. Are they going after, are their torpedo bombers actually going after our PT boats? I don't know. Are they just scouting? Oh, they are going after our torpedo boats. Well, seems weird. Just avoid. <laughs> uh, 
and I think we're doing damage. Honestly, out of all the things you could send uh, torpedo boats after, I mean, uh, torpedo bombers after, probably PT boats is the worst idea. So our we can finally scored some kills. I want to see their dive bombers in action. That, that seems like it actually will be fun to watch. So are they actually approaching the target? We see the flak, wave of flak just pro appearing now. Some of their dive bombers are killing over into their dive. Taking out our 15 inch coastal guns. My god, we we want those 15 inch coastal guns. Can you scramble it all and save this? Maybe not. Wait, we have one right here. Can you just... I mean, this would be an impossible shot, but if you could make it, just prevent them from destroying my... No. Okay. Well, we're entering combat, I guess. Seems a little bit weird to be entering combat in the same spot. Okay, fine, fair enough. This is just intense, though. So they've destroyed my 15-inch guns. Good on them. Frankly, good on them. That's what I would hope they would do. Is attack. Uh, they're diving on my hospital. They've destroyed that. They have left a lot of the flak up, so they are taking some pretty bad casualties. And again, we have wildcats circling and, you know, trying to do their thing. We have more wildcats available, too, which really need to get going. There it goes. <coughs> um, those guys are engaged. So that guy's done. Good. So you just basically gain altitude and get going towards their fleet. We don't know what you're needed to do, what we need you to do yet, but okay. You guys are engaging. Can you just kill one zero? Answer is. Survey says uh, one, two, three, four. This is embarrassing. <laughs> I mean, not just embarrassing. Like I'm not talking about the performance of our fighters. I think it's <laughs> embarrassing from the balance perspective or the QA of the game because this is impossible. <laughs> this is how did this get by the <laughs> the play testing? Who allowed this <laughs> to happen? <laughs> Maybe it's just different if you're in the... I keep telling myself it's probably different if you're in the tactical screen. If you're on the strategic map, maybe these things make sense. I'm hoping. Oh, wow. Just otherwise... Jeez, holy cow. Okay, but anyways, we have more aircraft to send out. Plenty more. And we have two Dauntlesses, which are going with them. In fact, we'll launch the Dauntlesses first, give them an attack order, and then we'll immediately launch their escort of four Wildcats, who hopefully can just act as bodyguards and like body block the uh, enemy fighters. I don't know what other use they'll be. <laughs> they, they just don't do anything. They can shoot down enemy um, non-fighter, non-interceptors, the dive bombers, the torpedo bombers, but they just seem completely useless against anything else. And boy, that is frustrating. What the hell? We got VTOL aircraft or something. Amazing. I like it. Is this guy... What is this Zero doing? Can we engage him? Who is he going after? Is he approaching the island? Because if he's approaching the island, I'm okay to let him take some anti-aircraft. Which might be the only way to kill them. <laughs> so, let it happen. But if they're coming in, I don't think they're coming in on my... I think that's a scouting party. Okay, so let's pursue their aircraft. And this is the historical way it would happen, right? You'd pursue their aircraft back to their carriers. 
We have our PT boats launching a suicide mission to defend. We already have some... I mean, there's been casualties, right? They have bombed, they've hit our 15-inch coastal battery, which is was just an amazing thing to have. We do have some others, though. So this is a pretty well-defended... Um, they're going to need more waves, basically. 15-inch. Okay, so we didn't lose a lot. And, oh my gosh, look at this. We have... Plenty of defenses left, guarding our fuel supplies. Okay, so we're we're things aren't hopeless quite yet, despite the fact that things have not gone exceptionally well. Um, wait, are you over a? I think the zero is trying to attack me. I wonder if I could gang up. I think I've done all these tests before, but I wonder if I could gang up on them. He's just stuck in like an infinite loop or something. All right, well, let's have this guy go back first directly so that we can scout. Like, what? Oh, my God. What are all these things doing? Okay, I don't know what you're doing, but can you just... Can I give you a move order? Yes, that will work. All right, let's just have you engage one of these zeros because if you're bugged and they're bugged, well, maybe two bugged things cancel each other out. I mean, this group is actually getting through, and they have bombs. I could go bomb their, <laughs> their fleet. These bombs are worth, like, one point of damage. Basically, they're just... I'm, I'm imagining, like, a 100-pound bomb, or maybe a 50-pound, 5-0, 50-pound bomb. <coughs> Excuse me. So let's just... I don't know. Let's, I guess, just go intercept their fighters. these guys to be a formation and let's go after somebody okay these guys are obviously whoops these guys are about to duke it out let's get off <laughs> get off the main <laughs> all right four versus four just attack them what are you doing what are you doing Oh, there. We go. Yeah, wait. Uh, nine fighters. What the hell? Engage. I think we're bugged again. So, if I were can read this correctly, four. Maybe I shouldn't swap out of the tactical and the other map. I don't know. I really don't know. I don't know how to best navigate this. And you know what? I'll, I'll solicit any kind of feedback. If anybody knows how to do this in a way where it's not so buggy, I would be like, no, what are you returning? Okay, I, I, we took one out. We took out two, it looks like. Amazing. These are the kind of odds I can live for. And you're like over the fleet. Oh my gosh. We might as well drop our bomb. Um, okay, let's just drop it on Kiroshima. I doubt we'll be able to, but... We're going for it. A little bit more this way. All right, <laughs> we did it. <laughs> Mission accomplished. Go home. <laughs> Go intercept a fighter. I highly doubt this is going to hit, but hey, we had some fun lining up a manual bomb bombing run. We're going to give the Kirishima something to think about, that's for sure. She's going to have a bomb drop near her, and hopefully that can discourage her. Here it comes. Small victories is what we could use right now. Looks like it's gonna miss. But look at that. 
It was not too far off. They feel threatened, I think. And we're wasting their anti-aircraft... Okay, well, maybe not a total waste, but... Ah, uh, trying to look at this in a glass-half-full type situation. I don't really know how to view this <laughs> through a positive lens. Um, are you engaging this? Because if you are, I mean, if you aren't, do it. Maybe 2v1? What? No, engage. Engage this guy. What? He's he's attacking you. He's he's attacking you for crying out loud. Engage. Oh, what the hell? Uh, what? Who? Did we? We did it. We did it. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, it's a miracle. Okay, so let's take a note to self. How did I do this? I gave a bunch of random movement orders. Oh my gosh, the heroes! The heroes of Midway! My goodness! The heroes of Midway! We found them! Go intercept someone else! Oh, that was amazing! So, we give a lot of movement orders when we're in the uh, actual scuffle, and that is how we can get victory. I am not, uh, I guess I'm not opposed to cheesing the game really would have rather not be like this but okay so we have three aircraft out they have a zero coming by let's what do we want to do about this situation I, I probably need to just I kind of feel like being absurd I don't want to be I don't want to ruin the immersion but I feel like launching a bunch of B-17s which could be based on Midway and just trying to get one or two through Yeah, let's do it. I mean, mostly what I would want to do is... Oops. Take out their fighters, and this does not accomplish that at all. But it's kind of... I, I think I'll manually bomb with these so that the chance of me hitting is pretty small. Let's get rid of all this. Alright, so this is going to be kind of funny. We'll just do a massive B-17 bombing raid. We'll assume that this came from the island or somewhere else. Um, some B-17 station nearby. And then after that, we'll switch back to only fighters for, for the rest. Or maybe some Dauntless. I don't know. But we'll go back to like things we would expect to be there. Okay, so when you're... Whoa! I guess we're shooting down those things. Yeah, climb immediately. Climb immediately climb immediately and climb immediately although I'm not gonna be able to control things <laughs> well unfortunately the results of this are gonna have to wait until next time and I think you know we might get lucky with one of these B-17s we certainly uh, don't expect to <laughs> And we'll continue this little ongoing saga of, uh, I don't know how to describe it, it's a very bizarre mix of a beautiful game with uh, some challenges built in, trying to get, um, trying to get something realistic. <laughs> um, the Wildcats did, in the end, turn out to be okay. Are these guys intercepting? Yes. Yeah, and I, uh, there's no option for me to fly my B-17s in formation, so they're just getting shot down pretty much right away. So, yeah, this B-17 run will be a bust, unfortunately. We won't gain enough altitude quickly enough to, to avoid them. Uh, yeah, that would be the one saving grace, is if these aircraft were able to gain altitude high enough to avoid the zeros, but the zeros do climb very quickly, and on top of that, uh, even though the max range, max height for these is 10,800, oops, so we have some more Kates coming back in, actually we might, oh no, there's a zero right there, but, wait, this, this might be a chance, there's only, what, one set of zeros up here? Does that mean one will survive? Because that means this one's probably doomed, but 
Does that mean that one of our aircraft might get through? We only need one, but let's find out next time. <laughs> Until then, thanks for watching and take care.